Hey guys, what's going on? My name's Thomas, and um, this is a quick video sh um, where I'm going to tell you how I fixed my uh, G27 steering wheel. So I had a problem where um, when you plug it in to the computer, I'll just plug it in this one to show you because I've actually fixed it. Um, it does its initializing thing, and then um, sometimes this light goes out here. I don't know if you can see it, and um, that light goes out like that, and then. Uh, the steering wheel basically disconnects from the computer and then um, maybe it might reconnect, you know. If you have this problem, then I'm going to show you how to fix it. So what you want to do is you want to um, obviously leave it plugged into the USB thing. Um, come over to here. Hi. Hey guys, what is going on? So, sorry about that. I'm just going to show you on the computer what you do. So then when you're going to go to open up your control panel. It should be on your desktop. If not, um, just watch another video on how to bring up your control panel. It's really easy. Then what you do, you want to go to um, your devices printers, and um, when this thing loads, you just want to check to see if your G27 is showing up, because obviously it's uh, it's unplugged because the light's not on and uh, it's still unresponsive. So when this loads, which will take forever. Usually takes forever to load. Um, yeah, see it's showing up here, but obviously it doesn't work. So you want, you want to go back to your control panel and open up your device manager. Now this might be a bit confusing, um, but you want to open up these U uh, Universal Serial Bus controllers, um, and um, you either look for one that says G27 Racing Wheel, or you. Um, um, it should show up here. If not, um, I don't really know. Yeah, sorry. Um, but what you want to do is you want to um, go to properties. You want to go to your drivers, and you want to go um, driver details. Actually, no. You want to go to um, update your driver, and then what you want to do is you want to go browse on my computer, and then you want to click um, let me pick, and then you pick this one. Or you want to check driving force USB. This is the default one. Uh, it might have been like a I think there might have been like a faulty um, drive update or something, I don't know. But it's, um, it's beginning to break. So what you want to do is you want to click Logitech Driving Force USB, hit next, and it will install it. The steering wheel does its initialize and stays again, and the light should stay on. Because that's what it, that's how I fixed it. And as you see, it's fixed. Hopefully. Um, but um, I'll check, I'll, um, I'll try it for a couple of days. And it always says there's Logitech Driving Force, and you've changed the drivers. And now it should disappear and go into this pile here. So, if you guys enjoyed this video and it helped you, please leave a like. Um, if not, then give a dislike, but mm, a like would be appreciated. And if you're new, um, hit the subscribe button because I do. Um, I'm going to be hopefully starting up some daily videos again. Um, I apologize for not other them. I've just been really busy. Um, so yeah, guys, um, if that fixed your G27, um. You're welcome. If not, um, I'm really sorry this didn't help you. Um, but this has only just happened to me today, and I've only just fixed it today. So, um, you know, I've been looking around, I've been trying to get the warranty and all that fixed on it to try and get a new one. And then I realised, oh, let me just try changing the drivers. And uh, hopefully it's fixed. Um, um, so, yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video, guys. Peace.